Bath and Body Works Road Trip Collection for Autumn or Fall of 2022. Let's go! Ang ganda ganda ng packaging nila, pero hindi ko sila binili lahat because I've already tested most of them. I had most of them in my collection except the two that were new, which is Autumn Drive and Golden Hour Coast. But I have them in decan, so we will review them in detail today. Welcome or welcome back. This is Mia. This is a channel where we talk about fragrance and lifestyle content. So if you're into that, please consider subscribing. So yeah, let's talk about the... Oops, sorry. Um, I've already had um, yung full bottle ng crisp morning air, ng twilight woods, and ng sunrise woods. But yung natira na lang sa akin is this one, um, yung sunrise woods. It's also a good packaging. Maganda rin naman yung packaging niya. Um, yung crisp morning air and yung twilight woods also has a pretty good packaging from I think that was last year. Pero hindi ko sila masyadong nagustuhan si crisp morning air and si twilight woods. Si twilight, twilight woods is a little too mature for me so I gave them, it's not really gave them away. I sold them. Uh, <laughs> I decluttered them, that's the term. I decluttered them, but I have, before I decluttered them, I have written my notes in my my fragrance notebook. It's also a painting from Van Gogh notebook. <laughs> Let's start with crisp morning air. So crisp morning air is crisp fall, bleh, oh my god, I forgot how to read. Crisp fall breeze, golden amber wood, and juicy apple. So the opening yeah, is that juicy apple uh, with some tart notes. So when I say tart, it's like bittersweet kind of scent. Um, yung mid notes niya lumalabas yung fresh woody notes in the background. Um, kung nakita niyo yung packaging ni Crisp Morning Air, it's like a mountain range. Yung packaging niya yung pinapakita niya don, so it should evoke that um, feeling na nasa mountain side ka, but you can smell apples. <laughs> yeah, apples. Um, it smelled to me like an air freshener, uh, but sweeter than an air freshener. Don't be put off by what I'm saying that Amway air freshener. It's just what it reminded me personally of. But I know most people love apple scent scents. Ganun kasi siguro yung experience ko sa apple. It's most, um, it's present in most fresheners siguro that I've tried in the past. Uh, that's why it's like that for my experience lang yun. But I know a lot of people like crisp morning air. So, baka magustuhan mo yun if you like apple fresh fragrances na may notes ng um, something woody in the background. Dry down niya that amber wood fresh and sweetened but woody. Yeah, fresh and a little bit sweet. More like a fruit type of sweet. Um, probably from the apple but woody very fresh on the opening but a bit of warmth on the dry down there's a little warmth uh, on the dry down where uh, I think it's coming from the, the woody aspect on it on the amber wood overall description of this one is fresh fresh fruity next one is twilight woods so I'll put the pictures right here by the way um, this is oh my god I forgot to put the notes I'll put the notes right here. This is powdery, leathery, and a bit waxy in the floral. Yung opening niya sa akin. Meron siyang berry in here. The berry scent na nasa background lang siya. Uh, yung sparkling mandarin niya, I did not get that a lot because um, I love mandarin when it's in fragrances. But I couldn't detect a lot of it in there. Um, and it reminded me a lot of Avon fragrances um, in the past. So it smelled to me like something that um, was made before, like an old fragrance. It's not old like uh, smelling like a grandma fragrance. It's not like that. It's just something that was done um, on a previous generation. Mas tagi na wano noon noon na napabango. Hindi siya doesn't smell modern to me. It's an old one. Which means that probably your grandma or your mom wore that um, in the past if they wore Bath & Body Works before. Actually, it reminded me of a teacher. It reminded me of a principal. <laughs> it's something that maybe a teacher or a principal could wear. Um, anyway, let's move on. So we have Sunrise Woods. Sunrise Woods. This is the only full bottle that I have kept in my collection. This one is Creamy Sandalwood Sweet Berries and Cozy Cashmere. So this one 
Oh yeah, it's a woody cashmere type of fragrance. Sandalwood is the most prominent here. Um, so if you don't like woody fragrances, you might not like this one. Um, sandalwood is a little close. Uh, it's like a more potent version of cashmere, I suppose. Um, so if you like those type of fragrances, you will probably like this one. The sweet berries is not too much. Actually, it's just there in the background to add a little bit more complexity. So fragrance, pero ang bida dito is the sandalwood and the cashmere. So you have to like that those type of scents, you know, woody and the fragrances. It smells perfumey. Um, I think this was compared to a perfume. Xenia compared this one to a perfume. She's actually the reason why I bought um, most of these um, fragrances in Twilight Woods and New Sunrise Woods and to Crisp Morning Air. I bought that because of um, Karina Pirate. Uh, it's one of her favorites as well. But anyway, um, if I would only keep one, it's going to be Sunrise Woods. But let's talk about the new ones. We have Autumn Drive and Golden Hour Coast. So I only have decants. I don't want to buy the, the new I don't want to buy the new ones because I already have a lot in my collection and I don't want to keep buying um, left and right without trying them so yeah let's see let's start with Golden Hour Coast so um, I'll just put the picture right here so um, let's go back to my notes this one is Sunkissed Bergamot Bergamot? Bergamot is it Bergamot or Bergamont? Because I heard Jeremy Fragrance say Bergamot and I heard Soke London say Bergamont. US peeps say Bergamont. I don't know. Uh, well, anyway, Golden Pear and Radiant Woods. So we are expecting citrus, fruits, and some woody aspect in there. So according to the website, it says smells sweet, warm, woodsy, scenic, route. Whatever that means, scenic route. <laughs> What's the scenic route? That's that's a whole thing. Anyway, hindi siya very warm para sa akin. It's actually a very juicy type of fragrance. Yeah, it's not too warm. It is very fruity. You know, opening yeah. Yes, it is very fruity, like a ripe fruit. Um, maybe from the pear. Um, this is coming from the pear probably with a bit of airy floral undertone. So meron siyang floral na woodsy na undertone um, in the opening. The opening niya reminds me of Love and Sunshine. Um, yung ganong ka fresh. Um, ganong ka light na fragrance. But it's gone in literally minutes. I couldn't even smell the mid notes before it dries down to a soft woodsy sweet. Like a bittersweet type of scent. Yeah, it's bittersweet yung like it's a tart note, yung mid notes niya. Yung dry down niya is soft, woodsy, and it tickles my nose. Oh my god, yeah, I remember. Na babahing ako nung nagreview ako nito. There's something that tickles my nose. Um, sa dry down niya. Pero sa mid wala naman siya ganun. Pero there's something maybe spicy in here that made me sneeze. Pero hindi naman yung sneeze na dere dere. So it's more like a one time, big time type of sneeze. Asa na ba yung notes ko sa ano? Oh my god, my notes are all over the place. Okay, let's move on to Autumn Drive. So I had my friend smell this one. I'll let you know kung ano yung um, sinabi nila sa akin na reaction nila. But first, let's talk about yung notes. This is wild raspberry. We're expecting fruity. Warm amber and vanilla birch. Birch. Is that wood? Anyway, it says on the website, it smells like a sunny windows down ride through the colorful countryside. So, yung opening niya sa akin is sweet, fruity. Then after a few seconds, the vanilla, it's the vanilla birch probably. So, it's a woody, but it's a creamy type of scent. Amber is not that heavy in here. And Chan likes it, my boyfriend. Yeah, it's the raspberry that comes up um, in the initial spray. It's the type of raspberry na very sweet, almost like too ripe. Um, yung amay niya. But, bakit ko nga ba dun spray? There's something interesting in there. Maybe, um, 
the vanilla birch oh, i do not expect in vanilla na gourmand vanilla it's more like in the background yung bida dito is the raspberry actually so when i had my friends smell this one um i have them i had them smell this too yung golden hour coast and yung autumn drive and they prefer autumn drive because it's a little more girly probably because it's a fruity scent fruity sweetness scent um, and this one is more like a citrusy you know woodsy type of scent but this one is actually lighter um, this one is a little bit more potent than this one but um, if you ask me my preference as well I like them both not love enough to buy them but I would if I will buy them for the packaging I'll buy it <laughs> I'll buy it here with autumn drive I will not buy again yung dalawa yung Chris Morning Air and Twilight Woods because I really didn't like them I couldn't give them a chance because um I was thinking that I had enough to to force myself to love those type of fragrances because um I really don't like I really don't like them um uh, lang yung mga apple na fragrances na nagustuhan ko and uh, sometimes if a fragrance is a little too powdery like uh twilight woods and a little too mature um, it doesn't really go well with my preferences so that's why i left out um, i mean i sold chris morning air and twilight woods if you want more fragrance content check out this next video and i'll see you there